what we'll be doing for today's lesson is solving one and two step equations. The equipment required for this lesson is a pen, a paper and a pencil. The key words that we'll be using for today's lesson are equation, expression, inverse and operation. Okay, inverse operations. Inverse is another word for opposite. So, I've got a few questions here now which I'll be going through and this is the most important part to solve equations. First question, find the inverse operation of plus 5. The inverse of plus 5 is minus 5. Next one, find the inverse of minus 7. The inverse of minus 7 is plus 7. Find the inverse of divided by 2. The inverse of divided by 2 is multiplied by 2. Inverse of multiplied by 9 is divided by 9. Okay, for the extension, you need to work out the inverse of x squared. The inverse of x squared is the square root of x. And the last one, the inverse of x cubed is the cube root of x. Okay, the first question is x plus 17 equals 29. You need to work out the value of x. What is x? How you do that is you need to get x on its own. Okay, so we need to move this plus 17 to the other side. So what we do is we do the inverse of plus 17 to both sides to get rid of this 17. Okay, inverse of plus 17 is minus 17. So we subtract 17 from both sides and the answer that we get is x equals 12 and that is our answer to check that we are correct substitute that 12 back in the equation so 12 plus 17 we get 29 okay next question 2x equals 10 2x means 2 times by x equals 10 so now we need to do the inverse of times. The inverse of times is divide. So we need to get x on its own. So we divide both sides by 2. So you divide this side by 2. And you also divide this side by 2. And the answer that you should get is x equals 5. Now if you substitute that 5 back into the equation, 2 times 5 gives us 10. Okay, now what I'd like you to do is have a go at answering these two questions now. Please pause the video and have a go. Okay, this is the answer that you should have got for these questions. So the first one is x minus 15 equals minus 5. So we need to add 15 to both sides. And the answer that we should get is x equals 10. And the last one, this line here, it means divided by. So x divided by 2 equals 5. So we're going to have to do the inverse operation. The inverse of divide is times. So you do times both sides by 2. So now you get x equals 10. One thing I haven't shown is why am I doing it to both sides. So for example, if you have a look at this question here, I've added 15 onto both sides. Minus 15 plus 15. This 15 goes from this side because that gives you 0. So then you get x on its own. So then when I add 15 to the other side, that's when I get my answer. Okay, next one. Solving two-step equations now. Okay, 5x plus 9 equals 19. So as the title states, 
we need to do two steps now. Okay, we need to get x on its own. Again, same rule applies. So, first thing, we move what's furthest away from the x to the other side first. So first, we will deal with this plus 9. The inverse of plus 9 is minus 9. So we subtract 9 from both sides. So now you get 5x equals 10. Next step now. 5x means 5 times by x. The inverse of times is divide. So we divide both sides by 5. And the answer that we should get is x equals 2. Just to double check our answer, if we substitute 2 in, we should get 19. So 5 times 2 is 10. Add 9, you get 19. Now what I'd like you to do is have a go at answering this question. Please pause the video and have a go now. Okay, the answer that you should have got is x equals 1 and that's the working out that you should have done. Okay, again how can we check your answer? You can check your answer by substituting what you got. So for this one we got x equals 1. 7 times 1 is 7, subtract 1 and you get 6 so we are correct. Okay. The homework for today's lesson is as follows. What I'd like you to do, if you are in set one, please have a go at doing all the amber questions and the green. If you are in set two, please have a go at doing five questions from red and five questions from amber. If you are in set three, please just have a go at answering the red questions.